This is Jolie Boucher. Today I'm going to show you how you can use Google Keep to share your thinking about math. We're going to take some math snaps where students take a picture of a math problem and make corrections and talk about it. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to launch Google Keep and now the student would go into Google Keep and they would click take a note. So to take a note you just hit the plus sign and the first thing they're going to do is take a photo of the math problem they want to discuss. So let's say the students want to talk about number four, problem number four. Okay, they're going to click use photo. All right, once they have inserted the picture, they can now click on it and draw on this photo. So let's say the teacher said this problem was incorrect, go make the changes. They can now click on the pen and they have three different pens at the bottom and they can make the corrections. So they should count by 10, 0, 10, 20. So the next number they know should be 30. This should be 40, 50, 60. This should be 70 and then 80, 90, 100, 110, 120. Okay, great. So the student has made the corrections. They can now go back to their work. They can add a title at the bo bottom. So let's say this is problem four. And now they can add a recording of their voice. So if they hit the plus sign, they can now insert a recording explaining their thoughts about this problem. So we're going to just click on recording. I was supposed to count by tens in problem number four. I was supposed to count by tens in problem number four, period. Zero, comma, ten, comma, twenty, comma. The next numbers should be thirty, comma, forty, comma, 50 comma 60 comma 70 comma 80 comma 90 comma 100 comma 110 comma 120 period that is how you count by tens okay once they stop recording you can now see that not only do we have the recording at the bottom of the page i was supposed to count by tens in problem number but we also have the transcript right there. So you can adjust the transcript if they need to click and add any details, they can do that. And it just makes it super easy for teachers and students to share their thoughts about math.